fireball for dinner. Ship is off a first up sixth and looks a nice ride for you. Uh, yes, it, um, it definitely is. Um, he had his second runs tomorrow and then he had his first run and I think he wasn't that fit just yet after that run. Uh, I've got one trials and a few gallop on that horse and then he definitely feel better. Talk us through the trial that he that you rode him in at Happy Valley. What sort of feel did he give you? Um, Dennis Yip, um, told me to just sit behind fan cover for him and see if he got a kick um, at the last 200 and just uh, ride him a little bit. And then when um, the last trials and I sit behind some, something and then when I pull him up and he just um, give me a kick nicely. He drew gate five in the trial, barrier number 10 on race night. Has he got the early toe to get across or might you look to drop in again? Uh, I believe so. Um, maybe the drawing night that pick to pick probably will go forward, but um, I still believe he probably got enough speed to get there. If not, probably just um, hoping for the pace going too quick and I can just slick in maybe perfectly one hour one back position. You rode him in work on Monday morning. Does he feel like he's come on since that trial? Uh, definitely, yes. Um, he's got um, fitter and definitely fitter. And hopefully he can um, win the race. Back to last Sunday. Congratulations, a win with Sparkling Night. Dennis has been a good supporter of you this season. Uh, yes, thank you. Um, yeah, been riding work a lot for him. And um, as I mentioned before, keep working hard. Hopefully it will pay you back one day. So I'm just doing what I'm doing, keep working hard. Good start to the season for you, bit of a frustrating season last time, but three wins already must make you feel pretty comfortable. Uh, yes, can't be better. Um, actually, I start up um, nicely this season. Hopefully, um, I can keep continuous um, the luck. Frankie, all beauty first up. He loved the switch to Happy Valley with that win. Yes, last time, um, uh, first time Happy Valley and uh, I also put the chip piece for him, make him a little more concentrate, so he, he, he win the race good. Has he improved off that run? Yes, after one he's improved. You've ridden him back in the field most of the time. Is he the horse that just needs to be safe for one run at them? Uh, I think uh, last time he win in Happy Valley, this time I still put him in Happy Valley, but later on I think he lead a little bit further distance. What about the step up to Class 3 this week? Because he's been very good in Class 4, but can he take that jump up in one hit? Uh, I think so. You know, uh, when you go up to one uh, one class, should be the weight should be a little bit light. Uh, I think uh, lightweight should be better for him also. And his work leading up to Wednesday night, he's pleased you. Yeah, he looks uh, improved after after last one. Hurry, hurry, gain in race number seven. He started his career with a bang with a couple of wins. Did he just come to the end of the campaign last time in? Yes, you know, uh, last uh, season. Uh, the last two ways is not really good, so I just sent him to Chung Fa. And uh, in Chung Fa, I give him two trials. they all good, and then that's why I just uh, take him back to Hong Kong. You led up in the last trial with him. Again, he's a horse that's sort of come from off the pace. Might we see a different horse despite the wide draw going forward this week? I think so. We've got a wide draw, draw 11. Uh, try to, uh, to depends by the, the pace. If the pace are not really fast, I can, I can go a little bit, uh, uh, maybe third, fourth. It depends what, by the pace, I think. Are they both horses, all beauty and uh, hurry, hurry again, that have got good futures in Hong Kong? I think so. Yeah, both is a, a, a good uh, little blood for me. Yeah. We move to the weekend. You've got winning Dreamer engaged. Was there a temptation to run him in the group too? Um, I still testing this horse uh, because last season he had uh, some accident and uh, uh, so he's uh, not really consistent. I think now he looks much better. Uh, I tried him before this way, so I give him a chip piece. He looks a little bit better. So I hope uh, I give him a chip piece in the ways so more concentrate and then uh, to see how it's uh, going. Keith, you ride compassion spirit this week, ran fourth first up without a trial. So you'd be expecting some natural improvement? Yes. Um... I worked him after his last run and he feels in a good form and Manfred has done a good job with him. Got such a great record over the 1200 at Happy Valley. What about going to the 1650 for the first time? It did. Um, you know, when, when he's, he's raced with speed when he, when he won his race over the 12, 
but then he sort of got lose his speed a little bit, so they try to put a step, step up into shot in 14, and it seems suiting better. And now I think it's time to step up and try 16.50. He's no stranger to you. He's a horse you've had success on in the past. He did. Um, he's, he, I went on a race with him last season, and he saw, he's an um, honest horse. He always tries hard and gives you everything in the race. Without that uh, turn of foot that you suggest he might not have now, do you need a constant tempo on? Can he sit and sprint over the 16.50? Um, I've got a ba good barrier and it looks like well, uh, feel it's gonna, the pace is going to be on in the race. So I think I can just sit where, like just behind the speed and try to have a beautiful run. It's been a really good week for you. A couple of winners. Shadow Breaker last Wednesday night. That was a massive win coming from last at the turn. It did. Um, the credit goes to Jimmy. And I was before I got on the horse, I was I was still thinking I should go forward. But then Jimmy thinks uh, with the bad barrier, I should go back, and it worked. And then going back to last Sunday, the anomaly. He looks to be a horse with a pretty good future. Yes, um, he's he has um, he won on his debut. And he always shows that he's a potential horse. He just needs more time for him to grow. And by in time, he, I think he will become a nice racehorse. He had them covered pretty easily there on the weekend. Oh, he did. Uh, beautiful one. And with um, it's no speed in the race, I got an easy lead, and I just have every favorite happening my way.